From the first script on, 1985, when I started writing screenplays, everyone was for Bill Murray. Right. I, it was in his voice, every one of them. And of course, you, there's only one Bill Murray. But what at the time, you know, they were everybody tried to be Bill Murray for a while. Mm -hmm. You know, they all had. If you couldn't get Bill Murray, then you got this guy trying to be Bill Murray. And there was all, and it was that smart alecky guy. You know, you know, the guy who knew more than the boss, knew more than the teacher, knew more, more than the sergeant. You know, he was a smart ass, yeah. a smart ass. And then when we got Kingpin made, uh, we had this great role for Ernie McCracken. And we thought, oh, wouldn't it be great to get Bill Murray? Well, uh, Randy Quaid had worked with Bill Murray before. And we said, do you think we could get Bill Murray? He goes, yeah, I could, I could get in touch with him. We were talking about Bill Murray, but we didn't know how to get to him. And Randy said, I worked with Bill. I could call him. He put in a call and said, yeah, Bill said he'll do it. Yeah, he's like, oh, OK, great. Yeah, next Tuesday, all right, right. Yeah, yeah he's got to do it. And like, this what? was like two weeks before we were shooting, by the way. <laughs> we didn't have the guy yet. I said, who do we contact? He'll, oh, he'll be here. I told him where to go. Bill's got like an 800 number and, you know, no agents and, you know, you generally leave a message or something and you, you know, hear when, back from uh, him a couple months later. But uh, Randy's yeah. got the uh, the bat phone or something. He knew how to get yeah. right in touch with him. Yeah, he was uh, got right to him. So he called him up and he and, and Randy said, yeah, he's in. Is he shitting me? <laughs> no, really? But does he know when he's shooting? Yeah, he's supposed to shoot on this date. We never heard another peep from him for... Probably six, six weeks. Yeah, first AD, second AD, no one can contact him to no. set up a shooting schedule. No. I don't even know if they had his deal worked out. Like, they said, this is what will pay you. And he goes, oh, yeah, okay, that's good. No wardrobe fitting. All the normal things no. that take place when you hire an actor. Well, and that. then the day comes that he's supposed to be shooting. And we just sat there and waited, and sure enough, the day Bill was supposed to shoot, everybody's like, what if he doesn't show? You know, what do we do here? We're wondering, like, is he going to come? Is he gonna... And all of a sudden, he's here. You're kidding me. No, he's here. Came walking in. Yeah, in character, in yeah. costume. Yeah. It's one of the happiest moments of my career. When Bill Murray comes onto your movie and you realize he's going to be in this thing, and he, 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 the joy you feel being around him was incredible. You know, Bill's an unusual star because, for one thing, he's the only guy I know who travels without an assistant. You know, a lot of these guys come with five assistants, they have entourages, they got people cooking for them. Bill get, books his own flight, he takes a cab from the airport, he comes in, he does his job. He had come with the idea that he had a, uh, you know, the, the, he'd gone bald. First he started with the afro and then he'd gone bald. But we'd already been shooting for a month. Hmm. And we had done that for Woody. Woody had started with a lot of hair and then he got bald and he showed up. He goes, hey, I got an idea that maybe this guy goes bald. And we said, well, Woody has that. And then we thought, wait a second, that's awesome. That's, why are we fighting it? That's, <laughs> that's a good thing. So he planned all that thing. And then he walks on the set the first day, and you give him the sides, and he looks at it, and he goes, uh, yeah, okay, I get it. He throws them away, never says one word that you wrote, <laughs> and it's ten times better. Yeah. Ten you, times better. You, <laughs> you're like, hi, not you, you, hi. Hi. Not you. Hi. Yeah, that's that's not scripted. No, that scene <laughs> was, was done. That scene was done. And like, and we had learned, don't say cut. Just let it sit there for a minute. And he just looked around. Hey, eh, eh, yeah, yeah, eh. You know. But even the stuff that was, you know, in the scene, he didn't. He was doing it differently. You have everything going for you. You're on a gravy train with biscuit wheels. Gravy train with biscuit wheels. You know, we weren't writing that stuff. No, no. He, yeah, he does. He does what he wants. And again, it's like you let him do it because it, it comes out great. If an actor goes off the page, you want him to do what you shoot first. Right. What you what you wrote first. Right. But uh, except for him, the last scene where he uh, has to get three strikes in a row. <laughs> okay. He's. They're having the big. Bowling thing. We were up in, in Reno at the National Bowling Center. We had a thousand extras sitting in the place. But when we stopped shooting, he would never go back to his trailer. He stayed in that crowd and worked them. And, and, and it was the greatest thing that could happen because, you know, you got a thousand people for two days and they want to get out of there except for Bill's putting on a show. So they're thinking, this is the greatest thing that ever happened. And I explained, I said, okay, so Bill has to get three uh, strikes. And it's going to, you know, take a while, but when he gets one, the first one, you applause this level, the second one at this level, and the third one go crazy, right? This, the final scene, he had to hit three straight strikes, and we would love to just film it with one shot. I said, Bill, you have to hit three strikes there. And he just stepped up in front of 3,000 people and nailed it. Bing, bing. Three in a row, Bill. Strike, strike, 
strike. Shut the fuck up. Place went fucking crazy. <laughs> Shut the just fuck up. Fucking crazy. And even <laughs> the last one, one pin was like this and just <laughs> shoot. Like, oh, yeah. All caught on film. Yeah. yeah. He, he is unbelievably clutch. You know, about two weeks later, we're watching him on TV. He's in a golf tournament at Pebble Beach, and he's got a 55 foot putt to, to win the thing. Drops it. You know, in front of a national television audience. He's, he's just very. Uh, he, nothing, nothing rattles him. Bill's like one of the guys. He, first of all, he's a blue collar guy. Loves the crew. Right. Hates studio executives. Sure. Hates producers. Agents. Hates agents. Lawyers. Hates suits. Right. If guy with a suit would show up, you just say, honestly, you don't want to do this because if he makes con eye contact with you, he's going to go at you. Did you see him go at? Okay. Yeah, I've seen him go at a couple guys. When he sees a wrong, it doesn't matter if it's a f seven year old girl. A, a 90 year old woman or a 40 year old muscle guy is going after you. Like, he, I've seen him call little girls, like, you fucking asshole. <laughs> You're a fucking asshole. <laughs> Don't do that. By the way, they were wrong. Yeah. <laughs> but you would think an adult would just say, okay, I'm just going to. He's like, what a fucking asshole you are. Like, that's bullshit. I'm like, okay, Bill, come on. Let's do like, no, <laughs> you're a fucking asshole. It was on the set of, of a movie, and I went over to uh, um, her, the girl's parents. She was actually like nine. And, um, and I said, geez, I'm, I'm really sorry about this. I, you know, it's just, you know, and she, they said, no, 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 no. This is good. <laughs> this is good. She needs to hear this. Yeah. This good. <laughs> but uh, he doesn't uh, suffer fools. He, no. he doesn't care. He'll go after whoever he wants. But then afterwards, he, he, you know, he's got a heart. He feels bad. But Bill can't, like, see something that's not right and just let it go. He can't do that. He's yeah. got he's to say, what the fuck? That's wrong. You right. know, that's just fucked up. You can't do that.